Hello friends, I am Abhishek Inamdar from Keyframes Online. Welcome to part 3 of this tutorial. And I'll just make a slightly down. I don't want this object. This one and this one. Slightly down. Because we have to write uh, company's name. Amazon. So, the great Indian festive sale and this has to come down, forgot to select. Select and delete. Now I'll delete this one. I don't want it right now. Click on Polygon 3. Fine. Make small. And take a box. Size of this is fine. And I'll make a copy of it. We'll just play Control D, Control D, Control D. Now it's T. This one and till this point. I'll click on this above objects. Uh, for you have an idea, you'll just place a color so you will get a better understanding of it. I'll just click, click, click. I'm pressing shift on my keyboard and say multiple selection and now say weld so it is now in one object and clicking this big rectangle and this one and I'll say intersect intersect and uh, just you don't want this you can delete it off and for this rectangle I'll get orange color. Mm, not orange will take will take this color so it will not merge it. And now in this I'll take orange color. I don't want outlines. Click this object. I don't want right click on on this, so the, there will be no outline. I'll say Control G for group, and will be sorry. It will be 180 degrees like this. So now this is a one style. Again, uh, we'll make a simple uh, same thing. Uh, at that time if we have taken the same rectangle uh, triangle so the work will be have will be less uh, make it 180 degree right now right now it's all 180 degree and the same rectangle I want or it may be a uh, small big it will be give a nice variation also so let it be Just get this color take the star not so many of the sides something like this is fine I'll take yellow make it small small it will be a bigger one smaller one again 
something like this over here it will be small Again, I'll make copy of it with smaller one. I'll make this um, bezier. Now I'll make this thick. This now I'll just convert this outline into uh, object, and again I can make this copy like this with a small. make a combine again and now this part and this part will intersect I can tell it this one I don't want so we can fill the the same color or maybe yellow I don't want outline and I don't want outline here also so this is one group control G and this is one group say control G now I'll make a thread I'll say control G so I'll say lock I don't want to move this I'll take a Bezier tool right from here some hanging kind of feel we can give like this and thread will be some around 8 pixel fine and I'll make this I always uh, convert uh, if there is uh, if there is uh, uh, any confusion like in uh, outline I always convert the outline with object uh, because I don't want any outline should play a vital role in the designing so uh, it's my perspective uh, if you don't want it to convert uh, you, uh, you you can take the decision because it's uh, it will not uh, you know change the design or it any kind of things so it take and I'll make this thread tied like this and I'll place this thread behind that I'll say control page down now I'll one by one I'll just place over here what happened so this will be like this what I'll do is I'll make with the yellow because the color is washing out take this yellow and say yeah this the small size Again with this slightly bigger one. Now it has to go inside like this. It will look very good. So 
से कंट्रोल पेज डाउन सो इट गिव्स अ फीलिंग ऑफ द थ्रेट सो नाउ आई जस्ट सेलेक्ट दिस वन and this thread and make another copy of it say i don't want this much till here i want if you want more variance in design just swap the flag like this you can keep over here and this can be over here it will be give some kind of uh variation in the design so it will be like this this flag will go inside because any of this the flag will not overlap the design now let's say control page down and this thread also so uh in next part uh, we'll do more designs uh, we'll make more backgrounds uh, threads over here also and here also and we'll add some text on that and that will be the final one I think so. Uh, so thanks for watching this tutorial. And if you want uh, some kind of tutorials, do let me know. And if you have any doubts in this tutorial, also do let me know. And thanks for watching this tutorial. Meet you in next part.